Today's video, we're talking about activated charcoal and how it can help you support normal kidney function and kidney health. So for a lot of people that are outside the United States, they might not have access to activated charcoal, but you may have access to a prescription medication called AST-120, okay, that's activated charcoal. It's not available in the United States, activated charcoal is over the counter. And this supplement, okay, it's an adsorbent, meaning it absorbs those kidney toxins and can help support normal kidney function and kidney health. Now we have a lot of studies on this because it's a medication, there's a lot of published data on it. But in the US, you're gonna buy this over the counter. Activated charcoal is not something new or unknown. It does, come, does come with some precautions I'm gonna discuss. We've been using activated charcoal for decades and it's used in hospitals even today, okay, to help absorb uh, alcohol poisoning. Um, to help suicides, okay, if you swallow a lot of pills, okay, opiate overdoses if it's pills, okay, has a lot of uses, okay, we use it today in hospitals. Now, if you're going to take this, okay, you can buy it over the counter, and you're going to want to take like four pills per meal, okay, this is going to absorb a lot of those kidney toxins that are produced, and it's, it really helps support kidney health by all the research that we show out there. You can go as high as eight pills per meal, okay, but you really want to be monitored with this. It's not like some other soluble fibers that you can use to support kidney health. Because it absorbs things, it also absorbs your vitamins, okay? It absorbs some vitamins and minerals. Not all of them, but some of them. And what I've seen uh, personally here at Healthy Kidney Inc., and what the data shows, it could absorb iron, okay? So you want to have your iron levels monitored or you know, looked at whenever you go to your doctor to make sure you're doing okay. You should be taking a multivitamin if you take it because you don't want to absorb uh, too many fat soluble nutrients you don't want to take activated charcoal with medication and generally without any other supplements at least 20 minutes apart um, but sometimes that can be an issue with taking all those supplements different times so it's better to take them together than not okay you'll still get a degree of effectiveness and just to cite a little research here uh, activated carbon may increase clearance of uremic solutes that's renal nephrology news july 28 2022 they talk about in dialysis how it can be used to absorb more of those toxins have better creatinine clearance ast 120 is a drug we got tons of studies on that frontiers in pharmacology july 21st 2021 a little meta meta-analysis on a lot of studies out there showing that it can help support good kidney health. So that's activated charcoal. You can get it anywhere where they have variety and sell supplements, online, retail. Generally use it for the later stages of kidney issues. Okay, you wouldn't use it in the earlier stages, generally in the later stages. Where you're going to have more of that toxin buildup. Uh, so generally it's not used earlier. Make sure you get monitored by your doctor and watch those precautions that I mentioned. Thanks for watching everybody into your best kidney health. And generally you wouldn't use this by itself, you use it with other things as part of your good health kidney protocol.